Turn it on, turn it up. Two monkeys and a cat production. Far side chat. Poor hippie country boy logic. Wit and wisdom. Smoke and mirrors. Roll up, roll up, roll up, roll up. It's a far side chat. Coming to you from the east coast of Arkansas. As always, this is a two monkeys and a cat production. Anyways, the the book, if I can get right off to the start, the book uh, for the week is the New Testament. Uh, this one happens to be the New Testament and Psalms. Uh, dig it out, Google it, read a couple of pages. Book for the week. And uh, uh, the hat. Uh, this hat was gifted to me. Uh, there it is, mine. Uh, a friend, uh, I had done already toted this hat. It's a Texas hat. And, uh, but I made, I have made an observance, uh, about the hat. You would not have noticed it. Uh, no possible way. ESP would not have picked it up. Uh, but the hat is not waterproof. I probably, I, if I had posed the question to Merlin Bonson, that real smart girl in the newspaper that knows everything in the world. If I had posed that question to her, uh, she could not made, have made that observance that this hat was not rainproof. Had not. Uh, she would at least had to have had hands on. And that's the reason I discovered it. Um... If you turn the hat upside down and look at it toward the sunlight, you'll see small holes where it was sewn together. It's not a quality hat. Uh, I appreciate the hat, and I'm going to wear it. Uh, I really like it. But it's not a quality hat. Uh, if I was to pull a Sherlock Holmes... Uh, Oh, I got the thing in the pocket this week. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a bandana made out of duct tape. One of those, if I was selling you a pair of trousers down at the New York suit exchange, I would have one of these hankies in my pocket. And this is, this is my, it's the duct tape girl's way of Achieving that same objective. It's a, oh, it's a play on uh, favoritism. Get your points. And, and, and speaking of that, uh, if you ain't subscribed, if you're not experiencing that wonderful little yellow button up there in the corner, uh, no need for me to point it out. You, can, you know where it is, just punch it. Uh, leave a comment. All comments is is welcome. Uh, uh, and I don't know the music I have been leaning toward. Meatloaf, Aerosmith, uh, the band. The band was cool now. Uh, even the first of the week, I spent some a period of time. Uh, it would be hard to call back now just how long I pondered on it. Thoughts, mind movies, and, and I'm following it up. This is my form of leaving a comment for the mind movie I had. And then, as always, this duct tape girl, uh, yeah, free time's free time. You know what? Use it well. And uh, I've done a couple things this week that uh, actually fell in place that normally I would not have expected me to do. Got them done. This far side chat. And another thing too, uh, uh, this Sherlock Holmes the movie, uh, it's in the red box. Just go ahead over there. They put a buck. And 
Oh, just a multitude of shout outs that I owe. And, I, and if I do owe you a shout out, uh, consider it uh, this part of it. And um, as subscribers, oh yes, I forgot uh, a neighbor, the duct tape girl. Uh, she, <laughs> I know. You're going to find this as a amusing as I am, I hope. This girl questioned me if I knew where she could purchase, procure, buy, long, get them on loan, uh, sheep shears. Oh, I beg you to play backwards in your mind how long it has been since the subject of sheep shears has crossed your mind it has definitely definitely you at one point in time in your life have even in your childhood uh it may be where you're at now the country you live in i mean sheep shears may be a uh uh, well, you may have a power in your hand right now. The it it be it would the odds on that of some person using a pair of sheep shears is probably not as great as winning the lottery. I mean, there's a that's a shot in the dark right there. That lottery. I mean, just give them your dollar and throw the ticket away. Uh, <laughs> it's. It's not been worth the uh, effort. This, uh, the different spices out there, uh, by all means, take advantages of uh, even uh, spices. Uh, take advantage of all flavors. Uh, do not forget your basic spices, salt and pepper. Uh, do not overuse either. Let that be the word for the week. Subscribe, leave a comment. This has been a far side chat. Mm. Uh, on that scale of 1 to 10, it's going to be iffy this time. Check back. Bye now.